New details on a fight between siblings that turned deadly on Christmas Eve. Investigators say shockingly began as an argument over who got more presents. This is Nightside. I'm Carolina Lead. Dave has a night off. In a story you'll see only on 10 Tampa Bay, tonight family members are speaking out for the first time about how this all went down. 10 Tampa Bay's Angelina Salcedo spoke with them just a few hours ago. Carolina, this family is going through an extremely tough time right now after losing a 23 year old mom of two just a day before Christmas. Hours ago, they honored her life about a mile from here with a candlelight vigil. That's where I spoke to her mom off camera. She tells me that she was there when the shooting happened and is just trying to process all of this. But tonight, this family wants Abriel Baldwin to know that she is loved and her kids are taken care of. The pain is unbearable. Candles illuminate photos of 23 year old Abriel Baldwin and her two babies. They're now left without a mom. They're going to get taken care of regardless. Ariana Birch is Abriel's younger sister. She was a really sweet person. She was just special. The 21 year old comforted by the love Bree's family and friends are showing tonight, but she's heartbroken. She didn't know people cared about her. She thought nobody didn't care about her. She lost not one, but three siblings. I feel like everything is destroyed and took it from me. Pinellas County Sheriff Bob Gualtieri says an argument between her two teen brothers turned violent on Christmas Eve. You got the 14-year-old who's mad at the 15-year-old because mom's not buying equal amounts of gifts. Fight escalated once the family got to their grandmother's house in Largo. He takes out his gun and tells him he's going to shoot him in the head. When Abriel stepped in, she was shot in the chest by her 14-year-old brother with his 40 caliber semi-automatic gun. What she said was, knock it off. Leave it alone. Why are you doing this? It's Christmas. Seconds later, deputies say his 15-year-old brother came outside and shot his brother. Shot one time in the stomach. We are not naming the teen brothers in this case because of their ages. The 14 year old still in the hospital tonight after undergoing surgery. He is recovering charged with first degree murder. Those charges could later be upgraded. His brother is in a mental health facility getting treatment after threatening to take his own life. He's charged with attempted first degree murder. A tough loss for this family to process all three siblings gone right around the holidays. In Largo tonight, Angelina Salcedo. 10 Tampa Bay. Deputies are still trying to recover a 45 caliber semi automatic gun. They're also working to figure out if both guns used here were stolen and possibly used in other crimes in our area.